Hi, it's John Coach Mace R&D. Today we have a GT350 motor on the sim tester, and we're just about ready to start this up. And we wanted to show you how this was done. All right, we're going to hit the system switch, the oil switch. You can see our oil pressure has gone right up. And we'll take a look here and see how our oil's coming out. You can see it's starting to come out of the rocker. At least we've got pressure in there. And you can see the bottom. What's going to happen is these will uh, all fill up. Go ahead and start the motor. Started off at about 200 RPM. It looks like we got just a little bit above 8 amps on the current drive. A lot of people ask uh, what kind of oil I use. Well, we use a standard motor oil in this, but it has a modifier in it that uh, is specially built to use with the sim tester. Well, we've been running this motor for about 20 minutes on the sim, which is a normal. Time that we run them generally 20 to 30 minutes, and as you can see, the RPM has come up uh, about two to three RPM. It looks like it's dropped down below eight amps on the current drop. So, we're pretty well satisfied that this is going to run really well. The idea behind the sim test is actually to what we, what we do is an initialization of the engine, as I call it, and the whole idea is to allow the connecting rods and the pistons and all the other bits and pieces to kind of get lined up and you still need to do your 20 minute 2000 rpm break in of the cam but it's fairly well broken in once you get it anyway if you have questions about fords or sim testing give me a call here at coast to mesa r&d we'll see you soon